What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 Minds video. And guys, today, we do have some market talk. As per usual, the daily market talk has been going crazy. We're going to go with some snipe filters, some empty methods, and some overall market talk for this one. To be honest, man, I'm online, and I'm just so bored of this game right now. There's nothing crazy going on. Straight up, it's been strictly solos and grinding. There's really nothing else to do. They haven't dropped, like, fire content. Um, Yeah, man, make sure to drop 20,000 MT in the comments, like the vid, and sub if you are new. Please drop the subs, man. Let's hit 5k, man. We're, we're getting closer and closer each day. You guys have been smashing that sub button and whatnot. But yeah, 2k has been super dry. I mean, super dry. They're stalling for all-star content. As I already said, so many videos. It really... I'm just getting bored. I'm just trying to invest in some cards. And right now, it's not looking too good, you know? So uh, yeah, without further ado, man, let's talk about a couple things. Um, if you want to sell your team, it's not a bad time to do it. If you don't have a lot of MT stacked up, that is. So, like, this is my team right now. I have a lot of MT stacked up. But, yeah, this team's pretty solid, I would say. Um, but, yeah, man. I want to sell it so bad. But, really, I might sell Shaq. He was not doing the job for me. I might sell Bosh. He wasn't really doing good either. I might get Yao instead of Bosh and Shaq and possibly get someone here. I'm going to get Opal Roy move... I don't know. I have a lot to do. A lot of thinking to do with my team. I don't... Wade's not that good either. I don't know, man. I don't know what to do. But, yo. Right now, man. There's a lot to think about. Like, seriously, I don't know what I want to do. I, I literally just don't know. Um, You could sell your team. It's not a bad idea. Considering there is all-star content dropping next week. It's going to be huge market crash. They stalled for two weeks. They're going to have that huge market crash next week. So, stay tuned for that. But uh, yeah, let's go over some some filters, and I'm gonna tell you one filter that is pretty much only for Shaq. That one of my subs tweeted me I am on Xbox. It's very hard to snipe on Xbox. MT costs more on Xbox. Everything on Xbox is harder. But one filter he showed me was um, literally Pink Diamond Pacific um, Prime VIP Series Two, and this filter is actually so good supposedly he showed me pictures that he sniped out Shaq and it, i have proof of it on my twitter he sniped out three Shaqs in 30 minutes and he sent it to me on 30 minutes with his name like everything so he's got to be legit this filter right here try it out he said he sniped out three Shaqs and he sent me the pictures and everything in around 30 minutes and i was like what how is that even possible he got one for 20k he got one for 80 and he got one for 100k so as you can see there is a shack, so put your minimums out, whatever you want to do, however you snipe. But this filter supposedly is really good. Also, man, I saw Yao Ming for 90k um, earlier. He was 90k with a freaking contract on and everything. And yeah, he's going for over 100 now. Um, he went, I just saw him sell for 120. But right now, man, if you're on Xbox, I don't know if it's different for PS4. It's not a bad idea to try to snipe some Yao Ming's. Pretty, pretty solid card. Um, let's see Kobe. Let's see what Kobe's price is going for. I want to just talk about some certain players. I saw Kobe going for around 88 yesterday with some contracts. So he did go up again. This Diamond Kobe is insane, man. I literally... I might have to get him back. I honestly... He's one of my favorite cards in the game. So it looks like he's back up to around 99k. I expect his price to drop, especially next week. I don't know what they have inside. I don't know what they're trying to drop sooner or later, but... Hopefully 2K comes up with something. I don't know, man. Content's getting really dry. Nothing's really getting posted for cheap. Nothing's really fun. But yeah, man. It's been super, super dry right now. Um, we got everything at its peak value. The market is skyrocketed. Sky, sky, skyrocketed. Most, like, everyone's at their peak price. So, like, if you really want to sell your team, I will let you go ahead and sell your team. If you say you took L's, like, it's not my problem, bro. You just have to wait. You never take an L with selling your cards when I tell you to. Like, you could pretty much sell any card you have and wait till they drop all-star packs and get a W out of it. Because you have to realize, bro, if they're, like, how is Hakeem that cheap? I'm about to sell Shaq and get Hakeem. Hakeem's 10 times better than Shaq. 
Um, I'm literally about to do that right now. Um, I don't know, man. It's really up to you. It's like, I'm just sitting here. I'm waiting for something to happen on the market. I don't want to wait here and sit here sniping because... Like, if I'm going to wait an hour with this much MT, it's not worth it. Like, to make MT in this game, in my opinion, is simply just having mad MT stashed up and waiting till a sick market crash happens and simply just making thousands of MT off one market crash. It happens every time. Um, I don't know. Like, last month, man, during Christmas and everything, I made, like, millions of MT just sitting there and investing, like... I don't know, this whole entire month of February has been super dry. It's only been, what, like nine days, eight days? Um, and the end of January has been super dry. Um, I'm dying for a token market update. I mean, I'm dying. I'm so close to the Opal stage. I'm pretty much there. I'm just, I'm trying to get, um, what's it called? I'm 197 cards away from 300 tokens. Once I do hit those 300 tokens, we're going to be far, far away from a lot of things. But this is the thing. I have a lot of heat check cards to go. So as the market goes down, it's going to be, I would really stack on heat check cards, um, probably during all-star moments, everything's going to be really cheap. As you can see, man, I still got a lot of cards to go in here. So like, I got ways to go, man. I'm going to get a ton of tokens. Like I'm going to receive at least another 600 tokens from the heat check. So we got ways to go, man. And right now, man, I would really recommend selling your team. Honestly, there's really nothing else I could say um try sniping out yaos try sniping out shags you can even try tracing out Sh tracy mcgrady because he is in packs right now don't know why they released him but i got him for 290 earlier he's rocking around 400 000. i don't want to sell him because i played a game with him and he's uncoverable but i don't know man it's up to you guys on what you want to do i'm just completely confused on how they have not dropped content on a friday and they're not going to drop content today because, you know, 2K doesn't drop content on Saturdays. They either drop content Monday, Tuesday, uh, Thursday, or Friday. So they dropped the Legacy promo on a Sunday one time, and it was the worst one ever. But, uh, yeah, man, I'm waiting to stack up on Insane's Diamonds. And also, one thing I want to talk about, they do have the Giannis's up for cheap. I low-key want to stack up on some, but I don't know if it's a good idea. Like, 27K... For Giannis, like, why do I want to stack on him? Because, bro, he has 97 O, 98 D. And people who are a bunch of ballers, like, they need a Giannis. If you don't have Giannis in this game, you pretty much lose. He's one of the most OP cards in the game. And honestly, if I could pick up some for around 25-ish K, I could maybe sell some for 35, 40. He was going for 55 yesterday. Um, Yeah, yeah, he was just in the wheel spin. And if I could get him for the low, I would be pretty, pretty hyped. But other than that market is disgusting it's literally gross to look at and honestly like zion's going for like 180 bro 160 i mean i've been trying to get him for so long i get outbid at 170 160 it's zion bro he's 98 offense 93d i don't know man um bird selling for 220 Porzingis is selling for over two honestly this is just freaking disgusting i don't know man what do you guys think let me know what you think. Like, what are some sniping methods? Some other sniping methods for you guys. Um, Amethyst 20, bro. Amethyst 20 has been a filter for decades. I've been doing this since the game came out. Searching for Curry's and Giannis's. Just keep refreshing. It's such quick profit. And stuff get posted real, real quick. So, try out the filter. It's been money for a really long time, like I said. You just want to look for Giannis, Curry, LeBron, KD. That's literally it. And just sit here and wait. And honestly, bro, another filter. Dude, try to keep an eye on the Kobe's. Kobe's go up and down all the time. If you see him for like 80k, snag him. You can sell him for 100k probably later that day. So let me know how it goes. Let me know how all that sniping goes. Um, I don't know, man. If you guys want to sell your team, like I said, it's completely, completely up to you. I don't know if I want to. I have a stack team. If you want to sell Shaq now, I would recommend selling Shaq and Wade if you really want to. Personally, I think their price is actually just going to keep dropping and dropping. And then when All-Star Week comes, they're probably going to drop even more. But this guy, T-Max already up to 430. I just got one for 290, so that's a dub. But right now, if you want Tracy, this could be a really good time to pick him up. Then again, All-Star Week is next week, so I don't know what's going to happen. But yeah. Right now, man, not sure. I'm totally not sure. I just really would recommend selling your teams. That's about it. Just waiting on some new content, man. They got to drop content sooner or later. But yeah, that's really all I got. 
Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Have a good one, guys. Peace.